hey, how are you doing? Can I just say thank you for subscribing and then can I get straight to it? I want us to talk about public services, at least the ones I have experienced. I'd like to experience a few more, but can I just talk about the ones that I have had to interact with in the last two weeks? So of course, number one, KRA. So 95,000 people woke up to find out that their pins had been suspended. Guess what? I was one of them. And I remember getting the email from um, our accounts office and thinking, eh, me, of all people. And I was like, ugh, I, I, you know me, I'm, I'm an iTax and KRA champion, so there's no way <laughs> there's anything wrong with my records, all right? So I, I wasn't angry or, I don't know, worried. However, I was stuck in traffic the next morning after dropping my daughter to school, and I figured, let me call. So I called the KRA call center. Quarter to eight, the phone was answered by a cheery young lady. And of course, the first thing I said to her is, now, why have you suspended my pin? Me, I'm not Joho. Because the last time I remember there being a story about pin suspension, it was Ali Hassan Joho. And she laughs and laughs. And I'm like, okay, I'm going to let her laugh. So I told her, let me tell you something. I am compliant like a nonsense, so I'd love to know what to do. She told me, here is the email address. You've got to write and actually ask. And they'll look into your case and get back to you. And sure enough, 48 hours later, I got an email explaining and the culprit mm, in question and the two issues were flagged and I was told you need to ask your employer to uh, remit your payee and we will reactivate your PIN in, in a couple of days and it was done. But I really wanted to do this video to say to KRA, first and foremost, the fact that the call center takes a call at a quarter to eight, I'd like to know, call center of Sangapi. And for that young lady who took my call that morning, and it doesn't matter what I said to her, she had a smile and she, she, I was wondering how many angsty people was she going to deal with that day? But she had a great, great, great attitude towards it. And um, to the people on the other end who are studying every case and the fact that you actually write back and you do what you need to do, I am in awe of you, KRA. I really am. If you're one of the 95,000, can you not get all worried and bristled and na 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 No, they're also human beings. They're trying to catch some people and it's not you they're targeting. At least that's what I found out on my case. I'm not going to talk about my case. I know they have been able to find the organization in question that I did work with in 2005. Can you imagine? and they have locked down the issue, and I know they will sort it out with that other organization. But KRA, um, I did actually call your um, people at a domestic tax, is what you call, to say, is there anything you wanted me to add to this video? To which the Siku Pata reply, so actually, if you do want to speak about the issue, you know where to find me, and you know how much it's gonna cost you. <laughs> Subscribe and come back. I want to tell you about immigration, e-citizen, and applying for your e-passport. Because I did. Okay? Super.